let's learn some Spanish vocabulary about the living room. Sugar Astronaut presents Spanish Made Easy. Hi everyone, welcome to another lesson. Today we will learn some vocabulary in Spanish. Specifically, we will talk about items that you can find in a living room. But before, don't forget to subscribe and also click on the bell icon so you can get notified every time I upload a new video. Also, visit smlessons.com for more free Spanish lessons. Okay, let's get it started. So, as you can see here, we can see a living room. Living room in Spanish is la sala. La sala. That's pretty easy, isn't it? La sala has different things in it. And now let's see what we can find in la sala. The first thing I can see here is a TV. TV in Spanish or television in Spanish is la televisión. La televisión. Also, some people say la TV. La TV. It's just like saying TV, but in Spanish. La TV. Now, we can also see some bookshelf. Bookshelf in Spanish is librero. Librero. Or el librero. El librero. And we can see that the bookshelf or el librero has some books. Book in Spanish is libro or el libro. The plural form is los libros. Los libros. So, so far so good. Also, I'm pretty sure you know this word. This word is el tapete. El tapete. This means rug or the rug. You probably know this word because I have a video about bedroom vocabulary in Spanish. If you want to watch that video, just click on the right upper corner right now. Now, this living room seems incomplete to me. Let's see a different living room. Okay, this living room has some other interesting elements that we can learn how to say in Spanish. I see here some paintings. Painting in Spanish is la pintura. La pintura. And the plural form is las pinturas. Las pinturas. The paintings. Now we can see a couch. Couch in Spanish is el sofá. El sofá. Now we can see also a little armchair here. Armchair in Spanish is el sillón. El sillón. Also we can see that there is a floor lamp. Floor lamp in Spanish is la lámpara de pie. La lámpara de pie. Floor lamp. And also this living room has some throw blanket. Throw blanket in Spanish is la manta. La manta. Or you could also say la cobija. La cobija. Manta. La manta or cobija. La cobija. This living room also has a coffee table. Coffee table in Spanish is la mesa de centro. La mesa de centro. This literally means the center table because usually coffee tables go in the middle of the living room. Now let's see a different living room. This living room looks pretty fancy to me. Let's see what we can find. I can see here some plant. 
plant in Spanish is planta, planta, or la planta, la planta. The plural form is plantas or las plantas. Okay, now I can see as well some fireplace. That's pretty nice, actually. Fireplace in Spanish is la chimenea. La chimenea. The fireplace. La chimenea. Now, also, I can see uh, some through pillows. Through pillow in Spanish is el cojín or la almohada. El cojín or la almohada, the throw pillow. And the plural form is los cojines, los cojines, or las almohadas, las almohadas. I can see some fancy vases. Vase in Spanish is el jarrón, el jarrón. That is more like a decorative vase. You don't necessarily have to put anything in it or you can put some decoration. It, it could be flowers or it could be anything else, uh, like branches, I don't know. Or also you can use a florero, florero. And this vase is used for flowers. Florero, el florero for flowers, or el jarrón for flowers or anything else. It's a more uh, vague term, but both are pretty, pretty commonly used. The plural form is los jarrones or los floreros. Los jarrones, los jarrones, or los floreros. Los floreros. And lastly, we can see some we can see some chandelier. Chandelier in Spanish is candelabro. Candelabro. Or el candelabro. El candelabro. This means chandelier. Okay, so we learned a lot of different words in Spanish related to living rooms. I hope you like this video. Let me know if you have any questions about anything that we just talked about right now or if I missed any word that you want to learn about. Don't forget to subscribe and also click on the bell icon so you can get notified every time I upload a new video. Visit smlessons.com for more free Spanish lessons. Support this channel by sharing this video with your friends and by giving the thumbs up. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!